Welcome, welcome. This is Lisa Torres from lisatorresspeaks.com and in today's video, I want to show you how to create YouTube video thumbnails. Now, if you can see um, these people here, these YouTubers, have created their YouTube video thumbnails and you're probably asking yourself, how do I do that? Um, <clears throat> I'll show you some of the ones that I've created as, as well for um, my videos. You can see that these are the um, these are the thumbnails that I created for mine, right? Um, and you can create them any way that you want. So I'll show you how to do it. Just go to canva.com, C-A-N-V-A.com, and what you're gonna do is right here in this area. Um, what you'll do is you'll click on the plus sign, and you're gonna look for YouTube video thumbnail. So let's see where is it. Um, let's see. Social media. Here we go. Um, YouTube. Oops. YouTube thumbnail right here. Okay. So this is a new feature inside of Canva that easily allows you to. Um, excuse me, that allows you to easily create YouTube thumbnails. So all you need to do is click it, and it's already sized. All you have to do is design it. So this is the size of the YouTube thumbnail. And on the left-hand side, you'll see that you have some um, examples for you to choose from. So if you click on one of them, you can choose like this style or this style. Just understand that in Canva, when you see, um, you see how these images has these like uh, basket weave lines, <laughs> right? This means that you need to pay for that. So what you need to do is instead of paying for it, create it yourself. So how do you do that? Well, you do it by starting with a blank canvas. And now from here, you just build out your canvas. Now, I would highly recommend that, um, first of all, you get a picture of yourself. Um, and, and this is, it, I mean, you can use any picture of yourself. But if you want to create kind of the images how I created mine, you see how I'm like cropped out? You'll need to get your pictures cropped out. Okay. So you can hire somebody from, you know, Fiverr or somewhere to crop out one, uh, a few of your pictures or just one of your pictures or, or whatever. Um, start with a background. Canva has several backgrounds here. Um, you can go to, um, I wouldn't suggest going to Google and pulling images from there, um, but you can go here and let's say you wanted to, to do, because um, this is free stock images here. So what you can do is, let's say you wanted to um, get a picture of, let's say, outdoors so you'll see that there's a ton of it says free 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 the ones that say dollars that means that you have to pay for them so if I wanted to use this free one and create it you know put that there okay and then maybe I wanted to you know if you went and you you know you got somebody to crop out your image Let's see if I can find my image. Here we go. Whoops. Grab that there. Okay. So if I wanted to make an image like that, I can do that. Okay. So now what we do is we go to the text. And if you look inside the text, you'll see like there's already um, text designed for you. So let's say, for example, I pulled this one here. Okay, so and then we can change the color. Change the color to whatever you want. Just click on the font and you change the color. See, I was going to change this to black. Okay, you can stretch it out, make it as big as you want. Okay, and there you go. Okay, so let's say this was going to be my YouTube thumbnail. Um, if you want it to fade the back, 
you can fade the back of it. Let me make this smaller. So we are clicked on the the background image. So you can see it right there. And if I wanted to make the uh, lower the transparency on it, I can do that. See how cool that looks. Okay. And now you have a YouTube thumbnail. So now all you have to do is save it to your desktop. Okay. And, you know, put your words on there, the images. Save it to your desktop and then go into your video. So I'm going to show you where to upload it. Go to when you're edit when you're uploading your video and you're editing the video. Whoops. When you are editing the video, right here where it says upload thumbnail, that's where you're going to change the image and you're going to put the image there on your um, profile. Um, the reason why it looks like this right now is because I already uploaded my video but as you're uploading your video you're going to find the video thumbnail upload at the bottom of the screen um, in your initial upload okay only reason why i see it here next to my video is because i already published my video but when you first initially upload yours is going to be at the bottom and that's it and that's how you create the thumbnail video so i hope you enjoyed this um, training if you did, like it, comment, share, appreciate the feedback, and I'll see you guys on the next video. If you enjoyed this video by Lisa Torres, you're going to love her free nine minute video on how to generate 10 plus leads a day and sponsor two to five new members per week. Be sure to get instant access now at lisatorresspeaks.com, where you'll also find more marketing mindset, prospecting and recruiting tips on how to take your network marketing business to the next level.